Hello VC team, it is 8.30 and we have 24 hours to make this day count. First of all, I didn't go for a run, so we already have a red flag. I woke up at 7 o'clock and start working on my university projects. So for today we have 3 projects, editing and... Actually, let me show you in the whiteboard. Let's see, for today we have 3 projects from university, so... Other than that, I need to work on editing. I created a whole team around editing because it is extremely difficult to work in the university, talk with professors for the PhD, run the company and at the same time edit the videos. However, today every single member of the BBC squad can't work in this video, so I need to finish that. Also, I need to work in my presentation for my thesis. And finally, go and get my sis because today she has exams on IELTS. past half an hour for the theoretical analysis of my filter. More specifically, I'm trying to build a filter that has the ability to remove noise from any signal. So this is actually a really interesting assignment because you need to combine two things, the theoretical analysis with the math and all that stuff, and the programming part in MATLAB, which we'll try to build right now. <music> past three hours and I have great results. I just succeed to create the filter with two different ways. The first one of course is math that we already talked about and the second one is with the algorithm called gradient descent. I have some really interesting results to show you but I think that we will do that later because right now is 11.35 to be exact and my sister finishes her exams at 12 o'clock so we need to run. I think that I will get my laptop and mouse with me in order to program during my waiting time for my sister. Let's go. Let's talk about the program for today. Right now I need to go to take my sister and we will go for our lunch for about two hours. Then my sister will go and get her speaking exams and I will wait for about 20 minutes or 40 minutes and during this time I can program. I think that I will definitely be late for my sister. It is already 11.45 and I need to be there at 12 and right now I have a terrible traffic but we can't do anything about that so let's talk about digital filters. I already told you on previous vlogs the main idea of digital filters, which is to create a filter that automatically can understand noise and remove it. So in my exercise I have two main parts. The first one is to create a filter for a system that I know its properties. So I know that it has Gaussian noise and at the same time I know the transfer function. The main part, the mathematical and the actual program in MATLAB is already been done. So from the first part I only need to write the report, which I hate, but this is another topic. And for the second part, I need to get a real song that has noise and remove all the noise. This is a really interesting assignment for me because this is a real problem that you can manipulate and actually have some results. I waited for my sister for the past 40 or 45 minutes and I'm starving. I basically starve myself in order to come here and have a really large lunch with my sister. And out of that we have two problems. The first one is that my sister has exams at 2 o'clock. This means that there is a possibility that we will not go for lunch. Okay, I will not tell you the second problem because my sister just called me and I will go for lunch. <laughs> Now 
waiting for my sister to finish her exams, her speaking exams. And I think that everything went great with the written exams. She was really happy and she feels really confident, so this is great. I think that I need to wait here for about 10 or 24 minutes and then home for editing. Okay, if I want to be honest, I completely forgot you guys. So right now is 8 or actually 8.30 and I basically forgot to make any updates from 2 to 8.30. So first of all, everything was great with my sister, speaking, writing, listening and all the stuff. And we will have results in 15 days. Second, I was extremely tired, so I decided to sleep for one or one and a half hours hours. This is always a wrong choice for a power nap, but again, this is a topic for another day. Finally, I work with editing and I make a meeting with a member of the BBC squad. Right now, I'm teaching the style of the vlogs in the members of the BBC squad. So I'm thinking that I need to make up for all this lost time. I think that the best way to make up for all this lost time is to teach you about K-means. It's an algorithm that I mentioned about one or two vlogs ago, and this is one of the best ways to inspire you about AI and machine learning. First of all, K-means is an unsupervised learning algorithm. This means that this algorithm has the ability to learn something that you didn't specifically code. With other words, let's assume that we have some points. So K-means has the ability to separate these two groups. This means that K-means will find a center for every group and all the points around this center. So it basically separates this data into two different groups. Let's be more specific with the main idea of the actual algorithm. Let's assume that you want to separate this data into two separate groups. First, you will start with two random points. For example, this one and this one. Depending on these two points, you will find all the data around them and you will separate them into two different groups. So all these points will go to this group and all these points will go to this group because they are closer to this point and because they are closer to this point. After this process, the algorithm will calculate the new center points depending on the data of every group. So the center of this group is this point and the center of this group is this point. This means that we have an even better approximation of the groups. We can work with the same exact algorithm in order to get an even better results. So if you have this and this point, you will have this area and this area. This process will continue again and again until it finds the best possible centers. Of course, there are several details that we can discuss and at the same time, the algorithm that creates all this process. But in this vlog, I want to create something simpler in order to inspire people to search these algorithms and at the same time, don't completely bore people that don't work. Okay, it is 11.20 and I just realized that I completely forgot to work in my speech for the past three days. So most of you already know from previous logs that I will make a big speech in three days. This means that I need to work in this speech every single day. Right now is way past my bedtime, but I need again to work in this speech. So I will practice this 10 minute speech and then sleep. Right now it's 9 o'clock and I didn't go for a run. I'm working for the past 2 hours, so from 7 o'clock, in editing for the today's video. Actually, I can show you my favorite part. This is one of the scenes that takes so much time to create, but it is so fun.
I think that I will end the log right here because I need to start a lesson with my sister. My sister right now is 17 and she also start her bachelor at UK in 5 months. She is really obsessed with math and programming. So she decided that I need to teach her linear algebra which is extremely important for programmers. So I will see you in 3 days. Don't forget to subscribe in order to join the PPC team and as always keep coding guys. Yeah.